Hi guys, welcome back to a new episode of High Ride Garage. Paolo here, and today I'm going to present you with a very iconic helmet. And what's funny about this episode is that actually this helmet was handed over to the son of the previous owner directly from the rider himself. So who are we talking about? Well, here is a hint. You can see the brand. This is a kind of cool vintage brand, is Bell. Okay, nowadays they also produce newer helmets with a bit of old school style and new features. But this is actually coming directly from the 90s. And this is the helmet of one of the superstar of the American season and that's John Kosinski. So during the 80s and the 90s, the Americans, they were very, very strong. And John Kosinski actually managed to win the 200cc championship. And he also managed to win in the, uh, 1997, if I'm not mistaken, he managed to win the uh, World Superbike Series. So John Kosinski was a very peculiar character. Uh, as you can see, he still comes with the the uh, owner's manual so I don't know if you get it nowadays with the new helmets the owner's manual but uh, nevertheless what's cool about it is that uh, actually uh, during the race in Assen the World Superbike race in Assen there was a demonstration so the son of the previous owner who was working for uh, Xerox or uh, another company that was associated or sponsoring the, the team of John Kosinski and that's how he managed to make up this uh, uh, fantastic helmet. Actually, it's never used. As you can see, there is not even one single scratch. It's in pretty beautiful conditions and uh, here it is, John Kuczynski, and um, as we uh, as we know, John Kuczynski was a very peculiar person, very peculiar rider, beautiful smooth style, and uh, he had quite a character. So he would say that uh, unless a rider can win the championship within two years of the season, then he would not win, and he wouldn't be competitive enough. So this would actually hunt him because unfortunately he did not manage to win the 500cc championship although he was up there it was very close it was very exciting and he competed with the Kajiva and he took the Kajiva very very close up there okay they never quite made it even Eddie Lozo never quite made it but it was a great great effort and uh, John Kosinski also we remember him after the Laguna Seca race where he was the runner-up so he lost against Michael Scott and then he was so upset after the race that uh, he actually did not pay attention he was speeding and the cops <laughs> would not be able to stop him in the end they stopped him and they actually put him in jail so anyway it's uh, quite a funny character it's beautiful helmet beautiful design and uh, I'm really really happy with uh, snapping this helmet and uh, as you can see it really has the old school design, the American flag, the eagle. I hope that you can appreciate its beauty. And the old logo, and as you can see, this is not actually a sticker. So let's see if you guys can see. Uh, this was actually a patch that was put on top. And indeed, you can touch it and uh, it's quite uh, probably half an inch and um, and here you can see the stickers instead and his name like we looked at earlier so this is beautiful beautiful helmet i hope that you have enjoyed this episode and guys i'll see you in the next episode bye guys <laughs>